Hi everybody, it's Marcy, and I have got some fun things planned for us this week. Um, I've already started today's recipe here because you know most of it. <clears throat> I'm gonna start those marshmallows melting. Um, so today we're gonna make white chocolate peppermint Rice Krispie treats. And um, I'm not sure where I saw this, but it just looks so good. And with our white chocolate bars, I've been telling you how fabulous they are. They come in a box with nine bars and here, I'm gonna hold this up so you can see. Here's the biggest thing to pay attention to, the ingredients. Ours have cocoa butter, other people's don't. I've always said white chocolate, of course white chocolate's real chocolate, but then I started reading the ingredients on some other companies, white chocolate. First of all, if they don't call it chocolate, that's because there is no chocolate in it. So if you see white baking bits or white rounds or something like that, yeah, you know it's not real. So ours are, and if you've never had real chocolate, if you've only had like the ones you can buy at uh, the craft stores, ooh, you gotta try ours, because it is something really special. Um, and I've chopped up about five of them I am waiting for these marshmallows to finish melting. While that is happening, I wanna tell you about a couple things coming up. Um, starting tomorrow, I am starting on a very ex um, exciting adventure. Um, my friend Misty King has a, oh, and I didn't write it down. Got, um, mm, I'm gonna look it up before we're done. Um, she is a travel agent, and you know how hard travel agents have been hit during all of this. And she is starting a very fun thing where if you go to her website, um, she will, or go to her Facebook page, you will follow the adventures of her little character named Joy. And Joy is gonna, every Thursday, show you a place she's going. And then Friday, you'll find out where it is. Monday, you'll find out stuff to do. And then Tuesday, I'm gonna be there cooking with her to um, show you a recipe from the place. Um, so this week, actually I guess last Thursday, Joy went to Cancun. And um, for those of you who have been to Cancun before, you will uh, find what we're making tomorrow will be very fun. And we'll remind you of the street vendors there. Um, let me see, okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and start with these, even though we still have a little ways to go on the marshmallows. Um, oh, the other thing I wanna tell you about is next Tuesday night, the 20th, um, I am doing our single origin class. Trust me, it's gonna be really fun. Um, I'm gonna take you on a tour, and we might have a guest show up there too. Um, take you on a tour of the uh, four countries our single origin bars come from. If you order these bars and just eat them, you are missing out on half of the part of this, the experience. Um, you know, I'll teach you like the way to eat it and appreciate it and really uh, compare them with each other. So that's next Tuesday. You need to have the single origin bars by then though, so order them quickly if you haven't. Um, okay, I'm going to turn this down. Let me see. Okay, I've got my chopped up white chocolate peppermint bars there. Um, and Misty's Travel Agency is GoTravelGetaways.com. So look that up and look up Go Travel Getaways also on Facebook. And you will be part of the fun with joy. Okay. I use big marshmallows and it always takes so much longer. But you guys all know how easy um, marshmallow treats, uh, should I call them Rice Krispie treats? Yeah, because I'm actually using Rice Krispies, so I can call them that. Um, and I am not making a huge batch. Usually when I do this, I make a huge batch and like pour it on wax paper that's all over the counters. Um, Let's turn this up a little. I don't want it to burn. Um, but so anyway, with Misty, we're going to be 
um, traveling all around the world and she has some really fun things planned and I am finding all kinds of fun recipes from each place. Maybe not what you would always associate with it, but it's something that is from that country. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and go with this now. We'll probably use a little bit more melting. Okay, now I haven't quite decided the way I'm gonna mix these in. I think I'm going to go ahead and put them in before I pour the, um, the hot marshmallows on because they'll help melt them a little, but I think that they'll still have still hold together enough. Normally I just pour the Rice Krispie Treats right into the pot, but I don't know, I thought with these I should do it this way. Oh my gosh, do I smell that peppermint right now? And it smells delicious. Okay, now once it's mixed up well, we are pretty much almost there. This is why I like to do it on the counter. Eliminate one dish and into the pot, eliminate another. Okay, this is a greased dish. And honestly, this, ah, let me get this out of your way so you can see. Ooh, it smells so good. Okay, now um, you can like try pressing this down all you want. It's still gonna be a pain. So the thing I usually, I usually do and tell my kids to do is get your hands a little wet. I mean, obviously make sure they're clean first, but hopefully you did that before you started cooking. Get them just a little wet because you don't wanna make these soggy and push it down. And there you go, so much easier. And by the way, wasp count, if you're keeping up with that, was seven last Wednesday and so far four today, but I just found another one that will join his brothers. Okay, so there we have these. You can see the little bits of peppermint in there and I can't wait to try these. Oh, my special guest, you'll have to wait and see, but <laughs> I'm hoping she will be coming. So I will see you guys tomorrow when we are doing a recipe from Cancun. Um, and I've been practicing it. I never practice recipes, but I sort of felt like since um, uh, going for Misty's thing, I should help her out and make sure I knew what I was doing because I couldn't be like totally making mistakes and stuff like I do in here all the time. So that's it for today. Thanks for watching and I will see you tomorrow. Thanks.